Seems like a massive blow to Russia's war against Ukraine. Ukraine's forces saying they've struck the flagship of Putin's Black Sea fleet, the guided missile cruiser Moskva. I spoke exclusively with Ukraine's national security advisor. Can you tell us what happened to the cruiser Moskva? It sank, he says jokingly. Russia admits the ship has indeed sunk, but has not yet acknowledged it was struck by Kiev. Instead, it says it was badly damaged by a fire and then sunk while being towed in stormy seas. I think and it's this almost disbelief that they've managed to do this. I mean, we haven't had any confirmation that this was, in fact, the Ukrainians that took out this ship. But we're talking about the Moskova. It's named after the capital of Russia. They have essentially sunk, possibly, the capital of Russia during this war. I mean, if there were pictures of this ship going down, this would make headlines around the world. This is an enormous moment for this country. And, and I think it just serves to underline um, just in every way that this, that this invasion has just gone so badly for Russia, at least in, in the eyes of Ukraine. But uh, the reality of what this might mean on the ground, well, you're hearing it here. This is another uh, air, a siren here, a warning of a possible airstrike. And I think this raises the possibility of further strikes inside Ukraine across this country, not just in the east. This has been such a big loss for Russia. Yeah, right at the beginning of this invasion, the Moscow was said to have sent a radio signal to Ukraine saying, you must surrender, you must give up your weapons, surrender to the Russian Federation. In response, there was a, a group of Russian, uh, of Ukrainian soldiers on Snake Island, which is in the Black Sea, uh, who replied saying uh, that Russia could have essentially just, uh, you know, take that message uh, and, you know, uh, they refused. Let's put it like that. <laughs> Thank you.